On this episode of Dan Strin's Radar, we are diving deep into the world of web hosting and exploring the concept of decentralized websites. There's a revolution happening in the online world, and it's all about moving away from centralized control and embracing a distributed network of nod. Buckle up, folks, because we're about to unleash enhanced security and freedom in web hosting. So what exactly is decentralized web hosting? Well, imagine a web hosting system that is not reliant on a single vulnerable server. Instead, it operates across a network of nodes, with each node verifying and preserving data integrity. This decentralized approach ensures that no single point of failure can bring down an entire website. It's like having a safety net that catches any potential threats and keeps your website up and running. But how do you actually host a decentralized website? That's the million-dollar question, my friends. The first step is to choose a decentralized web hosting platform. There are several options out there, each with its own set of features and benefits. Some popular platforms include IFS, Interplanetary File System, that decentralized accessible content, and MadeSafe. Once you've chosen a platform, you'll need to familiarize yourself with its protocols and tools. These platforms often come with their own unique set of rules and technologies, so it's important to do your research and understand how they work. Don't worry, though, because there are plenty of resources available to help you navigate this new frontier. Next, you'll need to upload your website's files to the decentralized network. This process usually involves converting your files into a format that the platform understands, such as SID Content Identifier, in the case of IPEFs. Once your files are uploaded, they will be distributed across the network of nodes ensuring redundancy and data integrity. But what about security, you ask? Well... That's one of the beauties of decentralized web hosting. With no single point of failure, it becomes much harder for malicious actors to compromise your website. Additionally, the distributed nature of the network means that even if one node goes down, your website will still be accessible through other nodes. It's like having an army of guardians protecting your digital presence. Now, let's address the elephant in the room, speed. Some critics argue that decentralized web hosting can be slower compared to traditional hosting methods. While it is true that accessing data from multiple nodes may introduce some latency, advancements in technology are rapidly addressing this issue. With the advent of caching mechanisms and content delivery networks, seed ends. The gap in speed is narrowing, making decentralized hosting a viable option for websites of all sizes. So there you have it, a comprehensive guide to hosting decentralized websites. We've explored the concept, discussed popular platforms, and touched on security and speed considerations. It's an exciting time to be in the world of web hosting as we witness the shift from centralized to decentralized to decentralized. Embrace this change, my friends, and unleash enhanced security and freedom for your website. This podcast was co-produced by Daniel Aronoff and Mogul Media AI.